What's up guys? This is Jeff aka What's My Game and this is my vlog number six. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. As always, I can't say it enough and I'll never stop saying it. Thank you to each and every one of you that have even watched my channel, but thank you more to those have, that have subscribed. You are the lifeblood of my channel and you keep me going and it's really, really necessary for me to keep going at this stage of my growth with YouTube because it doesn't pay off for really usually many years down the road and for me right now the reward and the benefit is not monetary it's from you guys and making sure that I'm helping at least somebody every day with a game or making it more enjoyable because that's how I like to play and I know there's others like that so thank you each and every one of you I from the bottom of my heart I really appreciate it number two and probably more important than that is a special shout out to MJV1985. Well, it's not more important, but I just want to put him on a pedestal because MJV1985 is by far and away my top supporter. He gave two donations this month, which were crazy. I mean, um, I really appreciate it, MJV1985. I wish I knew your first name and I wouldn't share it you know, with the with the masses anyway, but thank you so much. I mean, from I, I remember when I was telling my wife that you gave a donation and let's just say it was more than a dollar, you know, and uh, it was great. And I, I and then like a few days later, you donated again because how much you enjoyed this Mad Max video. And I was just dumbfounded. I told my wife and I even got a little misty, you know, because, you know, every little bit goes a long way and it, it, it really helps me. And I really appreciate that for you to actually sit there and I'm actually thinking about it right now for you to actually sit there and, and think about what I do and how it maybe enriches your gaming experience or even just for that one video you, you think about you think about it and, and really thought enough to, to give back to me monetarily. I mean, that's amazing. I know when I set up the fan funding account, it was because of a, uh, a recommendation from YouTube themselves i had a conference call uh with youtube corporate uh, which they do when a channel starts growing i guess and um they told me several things and one of them is you know it's very hard to make money with youtube for a long time and you might as well set up a fan funding account so that if someone really enjoys your work they can benefit you, you they, they can they can donate to you i mean literally give you money so I was kind of I was kind of hesitant about doing that at first, but then I said, you know what? I mean, this is YouTube corporate saying do this, and there's nothing in it for them. Well, I guess there is because they do get like 21 cents per dollar or something like that. But um, though they get 21 cents for the first dollar, and then after that they get five percent. So they do get some money, but um, I felt like this guy was telling me to benefit me. I really did because I really feel like they want me to grow my channel because it can only help both of us, right? So I decided to put it up, and I hadn't had any donations, you know, and all of a sudden MJV comes through and uh, hits me with a couple, and it was just, it's just awesome. So it took a few days to show up, and then I thanked him, and then he did it again. So anyway, thank you so much. By the way, if you see someone that has a little, that has a comment, and then has a heart with a circle around it, and then it says supported, that means that they gave to my channel. Even if it's only a dollar that they donated, It'll say that, and that is so helpful to me, guys, because right now this this channel is, is for the amount of time and money I've spent, I'm at like 25 cents an hour. It's ridiculous. I know it'll be there one day. I just know it will, but my business right now is also growing. I'm spending money, not making money on that, so I'll be honest with you. Things are tight, and that, little, that from him really helped me, you know, just to just remind myself, you know, you know, people get something out of this, and I know... I post videos that I would need, and I know others are out there would need them too. So thanks again. So if you see somebody that's supported and has that word next to it, it's probably going to show up in the discussion part of my channel. Please give them a thumbs up for me or a shout out. If you can't donate yourself, please just you know shout out for them for me. Um, also, I wanted to uh, go over a topic. Please, please help me choose my next topic for my vlog. So I think that would be another way to help stay interactive with you know, my people is to let you guys create my topic or choose my topic for my next vlog. So if you have something that you'd like me to talk about, just put it in the description below. Damn, not the description, the comments below. And uh, just hit me with uh, what you'd like to talk about or like me to talk about. And maybe we can go back and forth. If there's if there's a, a comment that gets really upvoted, then I'll know that's the one I need to choose. Like, you know, if something's really popular, otherwise I'll just choose one of them. And I think that'll help to uh, for me to pick something that is relative to you guys, you know. 
Um, don't pick politics or religion, please. Pick something, hopefully, related to gaming, but I'm really open to anything. But politics and religion, I won't touch with a 10-foot pole. We won't go there. So, um, so that's that. That's the, the 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 news I wanted to touch or on or the the hot topics. Um, the the quick topic for today is personal. I was um, I was at my investment house, the one I'm flipping, which is what I've done. I've left corporate America and I'm trying to do my own business along with this, which takes up a lot of time and and uh, pays virtually nothing at this point. But the 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 investment side. Hopefully, we'll pay off. I just need to get this first house sold, and uh, you know, so I'm rehabbing it. So it's kind of like an all in, and then hopefully all back uh, with profit when it's done. So I'm almost done with it. I was getting a delivery of flooring and all my windows uh, from Lowe's, and this is one of many several occurrences. But I thought of you guys because I thought of a good vlog because he asked me what I did for a living, and I, you know, because I, I think people are interested in flippers. They're like, how do they make this work? And I said, well, this is my first one, and, you know, I'm living off savings, and my wife still works, and, um, you know, I'm making, you know, an infinitesimal amount of money from, uh, a, a, I told him a website, and he, and he said, what website? And I have to be honest with you, I feel a little bit of intrepidation telling people that, I play video games and post the content on YouTube. I don't know why that is. I think it's just me. It's a hang up, but I think it's valid because I think there's certain stereotypes that come with YouTube and with gamers. And so, you know, I, I sheepishly told this guy, well, you know, I, I, I post gaming videos on, on YouTube and I really felt it a stupid telling him that, you know, and, the good news is this guy was like mega interested. He's he's actually trying to create a channel too. And we talked. I gave him some tips because he has literally zero subscribers. And I told him how I got started. And um, so it was interesting. The point I'm trying to make is most encounters that I've gone through haven't gone that way. He happened to be interested because he's like me, right? But most people don't understand. And I think as time goes on, that'll change. But most people don't understand that youtube can be a career for a, a very few it's obviously like when i was in the finance world for 15 years it was more respected you know i worked for a bank or a mortgage company or a, whatever the case was I, I was confident telling people what i did because that was a well-known industry and people knew enough about what i did that they weren't puzzled uh they weren't really intrigued by it either but they knew what i did and they felt you know, that was I, I kind of felt respected. I was in finance, and I was a I wasn't a doctor or a lawyer, but I was a, it was a good profession, you know. Well, you know, now I just tell people about the flipping, you know, and I, I have a hard time explaining about YouTube and gaming, um, and I don't know why. I just feel like people look down on that, and they think YouTube is a toy. Or I know everybody watches YouTube. I mean, everybody. My parents, my you know, even 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 uh, other people, my age, grandparents, because there's valuable information on YouTube, how to do things and, and, and shows, maybe they, they're getting away from regular TV and they like a certain vlogger or, you know, some comedy channel or whatever. There's so much good stuff on YouTube. So I know people are into YouTube, but nobody really puts a thought about how are these people spending all their free time? I guess they just think it's all these people's hobbies. I don't know, but people only have so much free time. They can't put out good content without getting something returned monetarily. We all have bills. I mean, I have kids and a family, a wife. So I just, I just feel like people don't understand it, and so immediately it's met with skepticism, you know. And only my closest friends have called me out on it and been like, well, "What kind of job is that?" Like, okay, but what are you really doing for money? Or, which is true because right now it's tough. But my their point is is like, "Haha, it's funny." You know, what are you gonna do in a couple months for real? You know, and so that's that's all I'm saying is I, I just that's the challenge I'm meeting with now is is having. The only thing I can do to prove them wrong is to continue to grow my channel and eventually make a good living from it. And that's the only way I'll be able to prove them wrong. And, you know, it's not about them. It's about me. But I would be I would be lying if I said that I didn't care what especially my close friends and family think of me. And I, I think everybody feels that way. I mean, I, you know, we all want a certain level of acceptance, you know, and I've always been proud of what I did for a living or at least I felt, you know, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't hesitate to tell people. And now I find myself doing that. So hopefully one day I'll get to the point where, you know, I'm 
very self-sufficient. I don't even have to do the investment thing unless I really want to, where YouTube is propping me up and I'm able to just, you know, show everyone, hey, told you so. You know, that would be awesome. So, you know, I know Rome wasn't built in a day and I've been warned many times that this takes forever. You have to put in literally thousands of hours uh, before you even start to see any kind of any kind of monetary benefit. So I'm, I'm well aware of that. I'm prepared for it to some extent. But uh, I just wanted to talk about that, guys, and kind of vent a little bit with my challenges starting a YouTube channel and just come, you know, coming to terms with how different it is and how nobody understands it. Most people don't understand gamers and they don't, they're not gamers and they don't understand a career in YouTube. That's for damn sure. So I'm kind of, I'm melting both together and it's a challenge. So anyway, if you guys have any thoughts on that, you know, hit me below and, and you guys know I'll do my best to respond, but thank you so much to everyone. Uh, again, thank you. MJV 1985. You are the man. And, uh, I appreciate the donations, and and uh, again, I haven't publicly asked for anybody to donate, but if you do have uh, uh, the capability, even a dollar will help so much. I'll give a special shout out to you. I really appreciate it, um, and I hope you have a fantastic day. This is what's my game. Don't forget, put in the the comments if you have a a, a topic for next week you you want to talk about. Also, I have a friend that that found out about my YouTube page and uh, and he's interested in maybe coming on with me and and doing a vlog. He's really fun. And he's uh, uh, he's really uh, goofy, and we play off each other really well. So maybe that would be a fun. Maybe we could talk about it together and argue or whatever. So uh, give me some comments below and let me know what you want. And I'll see you next week. Thank you so much. Have a great day. This is what's my game, aka Jeff. See ya.